Are you live now? We are. Yeah. Yes, uh, we want to say very good afternoon, good morning, good evening, wherever you're watching us from. I remember almost of uh, Mr. Harris as well as the voting and members of our team, Comrade Kola Massist Edopai, our brother, our sister, and team, Blessing Abo. Our brother, the senior political leader, on AKA under the sun or in the rain. Yes, so sir, everywhere. Yeah, with all job. our comrades representing all the way from diaspora, can you introduce yourself, sir? Now the man is still The man is still in the same vein. Yeah, yeah, man, the comrade, that's the same thing. The man is still in not showing on your camera. Yeah, I'm yeah. 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 yeah, you are going to turn to show him whenever he is. Hello, bros, come and sit here. Yeah, come and sit here. It's only your face Yes, uh, our brother in Asemsha, Apostle Alfred Guinness, are always on his way as a result of some uh, unforeseen occurrence that may be improved human control. Uh, the logistics mechanism of our brother is having a little problem, so he said he's going to join the shop. I want to say a very big thank you to all and all people for your overwhelming support in the just concluded first segment protest against land grabbers in Edo State. If you are watching us, we urge you to kindly share this video and as well invites your friend. We cannot just say we've started a cause. We just want to, we just protested and we go into our rooms to sleep. To say, awene, awene. Yeah, again, yeah, yeah, no. We actually promised the entire world that we are going to ensure that we follow the activity to a logical conclusion. And as our brother rightly said, he said, and I quote, no one has the character configuration. That's the social way I'm putting it now. To take us out of our comfort zone. No hair. No hair whatsoever. No hair. As far as we no land grabber. No land grabber. As no far as we are concerned, our agitation remains. I will not stop. Regardless of the blackmail, regardless of the one by two flying across yeah. all nooks and crannies, regardless of the naira accruing to it, we are determined to stand to defend what we are believe in. The truth of the matter is simple. We are here today. We are not helping anybody. We are helping ourselves because if a door is good, it's for you and I. That is why we see it as a collective result by all our soldiers to be part and parcel of the process. I want to thank our brother, who I don't want to mention his name now, but maybe somebody. If there's an approval for us to mention his name publicly, and our sister away from diaspora, and many more who have supported this protest immensely. Mm -hmm. I won't deceive you. We, we are spending our resources, but we cannot deceive you that people are not as well giving support like them, like, like those in our group. Mm -hmm. So we won't dispute that. Even if anybody goes out to say, not mind them, not mind them, we are we are too limited as an individual. To be able to single handedly fund the struggle to the end. We are too limited. That is the truth. So we want to say a very big thank you for to all. And uh, we are saying we remain fair and resolute in achieving a specific goal. We we'll never allow distraction. If we want to take bribe, if we need revenue generation, by now this entire discussion would have been through a eh? of economy. Yeah. This entire
marital discussion would have been a pro discussion. Because the bride, the one by two, is flying around all those and crowding of a new state. But we do not need it. Good name, they say, is better than riches. Influence is better than money. May God bless you. I want to open the podium for my brother, our brother, Masis Kola Dentopari. Yes. Tell us good. Yes, thank you very much. I want to use this opportunity to greet my brothers and sisters in the old home and diaspora for their stupendous contribution to ensure that our protests come on Monday. The great company. Despite the intimidation, despite the empty threats uh, from some from some quarters, but we speak about that day, register our protest, and I want to use this opportunity to condemn in totality the the anti-Diluvian, the anachronistic, the barbaric. The primitive, the horrendous, satanic, monstrous, and odious act of the Nigeria of the Nigeria police led by the Commissioner of Police, CP Philip Ubadu, who unlawfully detained peaceful protesters. And the speaker of Edo State as of assembly, the right to freedom of association and peaceful assembly, freedom of movement, freedom of expression are fundamental human rights guaranteed by the 1999 Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria as amended. Universal Declaration of Human Rights, African Charter on Human and People's Rights. The Commissioner of Police should tender and reserve apology yes. to us. He has no right whatsoever to infringe on our fundamental human rights. We are not living in a banana republic. We are not operating fascism. We are not operating despotism. We are not operating authoritarianism or totalitarianism. We have the right to protest. It's stifled by the police. No, no, no. We are very, very conscious people in the North State. We know our rights. The movement to liberate or to emancipate. The suffering adult people from the satanic art of land grabber is unstoppable. According to Fidel Castro, there is no army in the world that can stop an idea whose time has come. Oh, Injustice anywhere is a threat of justice everywhere. Our life, they say, begin to hurt. We don't become silent about things that matter. We cannot fold our hands while some stark hatred, people that cannot even spare their father's name, in the name of OE, in the name of communities, a Nokia, in a Nikke, or John Wales, or candidates of community begin to, to exacerbate development, begin to discourage people from developing our communities. We must join hand with the governor of those states to ensure that these activities of land grabbing is nipped in the bud. We will not fail, as our network will not fail us to also call on the on those, the particular elements that are supporting these land grabbers. We have some of them in the palace of our village not aware of their satanic activities. We have some of them that are some top politicians 
We have some of some of them as senior police officers from state CID, from AIG, and from first headquarters Abuja. In no distance time, we shall displace their nomenclature. They are meant to be written in our hall of shame. We are not before to shame them. Enough is enough. Yeah. Anybody that is strictly against the development of a those states must be must be crushed by the moving train. We are going to disclose at the next line of action. This is just the beginning of our protest. This is just the beginning. We are not going to relax. We must, we must, we must continue to engage these enemies of the people. We are not taking into cognizance the activities of some blackmailers. What of frustration are trying to see how they can divide us. The more they continue to raise issues that will divide us, the more we continue to be united. That's it. They almost continue because they also with the national said that united we shall continue to fight. We shall continue to emancipate our people. Thank you very much. Amala. Yes, I want to <coughs> commend you, my brother, for your fine speech. It's very clear and obvious that our determination remains unwavering. And our stance and unity in confronting this monster still remains ironclad. With this, I want to call on my brother, the most respected <laughs> former CPS in those states, the most respected and Susa, uh, 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 Ewire Morgan. Our very respected and good people, we cannot uh, thank you enough for the humongous support and solidarity you have exhibited since the conceptualization of this movement. Let me inform you that it has not been a smooth sail. It has not been a bed of roses. But we know that issues like these would always attract certain level of resistance that we are used to it. And it is not just something we are delving into because we want to be popular. By the grace of God, there is nobody here that is unknown. So it is not for popularity. It is not for position. It is not because we want to get something or gain something that we're here. We are here because we are personally convinced that there are certain actions that some persons continue to exhibit that hampers human capital development in our states. And land grabbing is one. Encroachment, illegal encroachment into a land that one has bought from you or from your community is one. Illegal demolition of a property that has been developed to a very substantial level is another one. The sales of land, one land to multiple persons, in fact, that's the worst. So we are here to call on the government, not only to call on the government, like Master Scholar just said, we are ready to partner and we are already partnering with the obaseki led administration to ensure that this evil canker one that has so much depopularized and underdeveloped our society is completely out of place. And for those, for those who think that without land grabbing, without these underhand land deals in our states, they, they, they cannot arrive. They cannot be... They cannot, be, they cannot be somebody. I want to let you know that there are better things. We are not saying you shouldn't go into properties and lands and what have you. But you must be seen to be representing the ethics and philosophies of that craft, of that profession. Not embarrassing other persons who are doing their legal business with your illegality. So we are asking, and we will continue to ask, no matter what those who aid and abet these guys as doing, no matter what they're saying, we're asking you to withdraw your, 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 your sponsorship. We're asking you to stay clear. We're asking you to tell them to, 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 
to, to, to go away from these evil practices because it has brought a lot of embarrassment to our communities. And we believe in the government of God, we Vasaki. We believe that the governor is seriously on top of the situation. And with our movement a few days ago, there a lot of development, a lot of positivities has come up. And for those who continue to want to, who, are, who have been attempting to want to divide us, to want to relegate our struggle, you are just wasting your time. Because this is a pro-people struggle. And we naturally will win. It is a natural win for us. It is not just, it's a generational fight. Like I said this morning, it's a generational movement that we go from generation to generation until government is able to naturally enforce the PPP laws without being called upon like we are currently doing. We will not rest. So don't bother yourself. You'll be wasting your time. You'll be wasting your energy. You'll be wasting your resources because the movement is a pro-people movement. Our brothers, our sisters, our home and abroad are solidly behind this movement. It is not a one-man show or a two-man show. It is a movement for the, for the entire adult people who believe in the cause of struggling for those who are the privileged and under opportune to fight their causes alone. So that is why we are here. We appreciate you once again for those that are supporting us with everything that they've got. And we promise you that this is just the beginning and the beginning of the end of land grabbing in a dose state is now. Thank you so much and God bless. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, I want to say a very big thank you to my brother, uh, the most respected, uh, Susa Eure, for that beautiful submission. It's quite obvious that we are not here for an amateur dramatic play. Mm -hmm. We are here to do what is right. Uh, it is also true that when you are fighting corruption, corruption must fight back. And we've just seen a classical example of some few days back. We should stop living the life of people understand. If I am for, I am for. If I am against and attacking the fabrics of the protest and agitation, at the same time coming out to say I support. We don't understand, so I think at, at least to some extent, as a human, we should be able to stand tall and straight no. so that every individual will know exactly where we belong. No cowardice, no room for cowardice. You, you, you can imagine. So I think uh, we are moving forward. There are so many strategies. But because of the fact that we know that corruption will certainly fight no, back, no, no, no. we are keeping those strategies till when it is exhibited. But what I can not just only assure a uh, double is what we are going to authoritatively assure is that this struggle must get to its logical conclusion. But one fact still remains don't be deceived. There are pressures coming from different areas. These people we are fighting with now, they are our friends. We are close in communities, we are relations. People must have been calling you to say, somebody put him also around. And so say, anyway, you know what? Call out what is happening. That's, but let me tell you, the pressure is on the ground. But you won't understand. What is a man? M O A N, he passed what you see in the spending of the alphabet. Many things is in. Calls are coming from different tributaries. But by the power of God Almighty, we are determined that we are going to continue. Regardless of the intimidation, regardless of the blackmail, we shall overcome. Let me bring my sister, a woman, a great woman of inestimable value. I don't know where she's coming. I say, wait, no, I say, wait, a woman. We say, wait, a woman. No strong, 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 strong. You say, man, then come, she come be. So as we speak. The man, woman, and the beings are most respected blessing of you. You have the. Thank you very much. Thank you, my senior comrades. You, know, you are my elder brothers. And, um, I cannot appreciate you guys enough. Anyways, for the land grabbing issue, like they've all said, it's spoken word, we are not relenting. 
we will not stop until we put an end to all these land grabbing issues. And in several local governments, we have work and we need to see. So if you are a land grabber, there is nothing you can do to destabilize us. Like I said, Iwere said that every one of us sitting here are known faces. None of us is seeking fame. None of us is as poor as they are. We don't beg to put food on our table. We work to put food on our table. So we cannot be bought. We are also contented with what we earn. If we are not, as you can see, first thing that is even making them jealous is because they are seeing the unity because this agitation is apolitical. We have the APCs and we have the PDP here agitating for this cause. We all kept our different sentiments aside and decided to fight for it to cause. So in fact, uh, there's nothing that can prepare the arena more than that. So we are not asked for any is it fame or is it monetary gain? If we couldn't sell our conscience when we had to do the previous election, is it now we want to sell our conscience? So oh, please, exactly. They're just like Kathy <laughs> said that uh, hundred one by two, hundred feet by two hundred feet is flying in the air, mm -hmm. and that is why they all brought out their teeth to back at us. So my good people of Edo, we need your support. It is your support that will give us, that will boost our morale to continue fighting. Forget the blackmail, forget... See, we were not expecting that they would just fold their hands and be looking at us while no, we're fighting. No, no, no. We are definitely stepping on toes. Mm -hmm. Because we are eating a point that nobody has been able to touch for so many years. Apart from the government, people have been talking about every other thing, but this is the first time that people came together collectively to fight this land grabbing issue. And you think it will be an easy ride? It won't be. We've all been threatened, the ally. We've all been begged, the ally. But we refuse because it is for the good of our people. So the least we expect from you is your support and not to relent. If you have your petitions, bring them in. Because some persons must and will be used as scapegoats for others to learn. Because when that doesn't happen, they will not stop. If it was to end with the protest we did on Monday, trust me, next week, They'll start grabbing lands again. They are doing it to have a protest next to be. Oh, they'll start grabbing to lands immediately. They'll start protesting. So it's not ending with the protest. Thank you very much. I want to say thank you very much, our sister. Listen, uh, the truth is very clear. You have a practical experience today, today, this morning, and as we speak. Believe me, if it is the money that we want to benefit. Bros, by now, we're supposed to say, leave your hunger on me alone, leave your hunger on me alone, leave your hunger on me That's all now. What are you telling me? As we speak, we know how many calls don't come. Lands are very Say, no, I said, one by, you know how much is a land in the economy? 100 by 100, you should have at least, let's say 5 million, 6 million here. So if it's 1 by 2, we're talking about 12 million. Not be the one we don't say, how do you know, but it, it is available. By now, you will be hearing us say, we start. This is not about the for me alone. A report just came to me that the Enochia of Uri, who sold, who, who sold the land to somebody, the person sold to another person, the other person wants to develop, Enochia of Uri, instead of the person not to that. But I will not conclude, not because not heard from me. Mm -hmm. We are not a group that begin, will just get information and begin to fight without hearing from the daddy guy. But the truth of the matter is, like that of Okoromi, it's only different. No, because no, the information no, is already at the public space. Not one, not, not ten, not fifteen, not twenty-five. Yeah. So that is it. I want to be laconic and direct to the point so that I can bring in our brother, Mr. Steve. Thank you.
Thank you, everyone. All the way from diaspora. He's a representative of a those in the diaspora in this room. I'm, uh, I'm delighted to be part of this project. I want to make it very clear to you guys that uh, the entire those in diaspora are completely on the line with the capital letter behind you guys. Thank you. We, we have had series of meetings behind the closed doors and uh, because we are actually the ones who have been hit more in the land grabbing, you know, racketing in every place. Because you know, we buy land, we travel out of the country, we don't come here three, four, five years. And our lands are just there. Before we go come back to one day, we go go. the land has been built, somebody's already living on our space. So when you guys came up with this idea to fight for us, you are not fighting for yourself, you're actually fighting for us. And uh, just the way we supported Governor Sobasiki during the election, we decided to throw our weight behind the struggle. But we want a liberated Edo where we can come back home and develop. Okay? That's just the reason. We, we are tired living in another mass land. I've led this country for close to 25 years. I'm them tired. I'm them tired. I want to come back home. I'm doing nothing there. Okay, but most of us can't come home because of the fear of intimidation and harassment. Mm -hmm. A boy coming yesterday with a city of food on his land in Okoromi. The land is already built. I'm telling you, sir. Yes, it's built. I have, I have it. I think I posted it on the on on the on the on the general wall. It's already built by someone that's not the owner. It's as bad as that. The guy came back, he took him a clear, he met a, 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 a mighty duplex on his land. The guy was surprised. Called me and said, this is your fault. This is my land. He said, don't worry, you're going to get your number. That's 100 percent For as long as he has the CFO. Yeah, I told you, you're going to get your number. But what am I stating? There are many people who do not have a CFO. Who just bought their land, they left their land there, today they can't go back. So this struggle is not just about anyone, just like you said. There are many different communities yeah. that are actually Comment. creating Comment. a lot, a lot of issues for the local people. I want to say a very big thank you to all of you who are there. You know, actually decided to put your name and your integrity as things, you know, for the betterment of the Edo people, both home and in the diaspora. I want to say a very big thank you to you guys. And we appreciate you all. And we believe strongly at the end of the day, we shall overcome yes. every evil. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I want to, do, I want to state this clearly. Um, first, I saw where somebody wrote that uh, we are able to submit the petition to for now. Uh, we are going Anyone to get back to you by Friday. Excuse me, by Friday, we'll create the central place. Yeah. You just by Friday, you get details for that. Mm -hmm. So, well, you know, when we're doing any of our things, we try to do it very intelligently. Because there's a big difference between stacky mm. and intellectuals. Yeah. So all our activity must be based on absolute intelligence. In respect to the man of the city of Ukulana, tell him to remain calm and allow them to roof fit to the best level that may be comfortable. Yeah, yeah. 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 When it comes, the principle of quick whiplash at all, solo, 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 Tell him to keep the sea of hope and wait. Let them finish the structure. I want to bring our strong comrade. The the faculty of peace. No, this this one is not for peace. The faculty of fire. The man that is ready to give them the way this. You will recall that when we were detained, he was the one who started saying, "We want break up. We want break up." This is like an untested. I have, to, I, have, I have to tell you, hold on, hold on. <laughs> All right, 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 right. the most respected <laughs> is Kelly. Well, 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 well. And I want you to back up more on your experience to be. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks so much, Lenny, for having me. Good luck. Comrade Kelly, Mr. Gamokal, and the president of Faculty of Peace Competition Worldwide. So, although you don't believe that uh, uh, every time <laughs> that I do um, go around peace, I think. The hallmark of peace is justice. The hallmark of peace is fair play. The hallmark of peace is 
So please share, share. If you have not shared, please share. Share and invite your friends. We need all the people to be aware of all this. Share, please. please share. Wherever media you are watching it from, please share. Share. Thank you. So you cannot get peace without talking about this country and everything. That is the most terrible that are part of this and very dangerous. Like I will say, I think this is started when when um, I lost my voice during the gate issue. So I lost my voice when the CP bad will lock us up. <laughs> so, um, like I said, this, this whole all show started uh, by his uh, Royal Majesty when he attended the show. And I remember how he collaborated with the uh, dear governor to have a PPPP law. And I uh, respected the Sumalasi of the chairman at that time. So we know where the struggle has been coming up from. Like every law, every law, when you use it and you test it, sometimes it's bad for you to now also uh, amend it to have a better way to deal with some of those uh, social vices that you have seen. Today, I, uh, although this is a public space, you know, I went to a property to go and check for to do something on that property. And no and I was expecting after the protest, maybe this uh, last grabber would have vanished and they would have relocated to Lagos, Abuja, and uh, even Sumodera yeah. and Ghana, and even in the Federal Republic as of today. Johnny Bo to fight for for yeah, agitation of uh, sure. uh, those who to are to our land. But I was surprised that when we got there, we were going to do some stuff. We have, and before this time, we have settled the And uh, they told me that uh, men are guard. Uh, for you to do something today, you need to make, make men pay. Members, members, the now the money they pay back cartage, the money they pay is still inside the bush. And I was not asking what I want is still inside the bush. I think I've done everything that, I, I, that I'm supposed to do. So, why this question and answer and everything? And I put a call through to because the person that came in the property is from the community. In that the call that I last spoke with them before they, they left. That is to tell you, if not that I was dogged and I was able to maneuver my way, to just honorary average a youth or a do man, a do woman who doesn't understand how to beat all these people. Mm. Well, the next thing you should be doing is to start looking for resources or of course and start dishing thousands of money to give them for them to uh, for them to smoke their India with and buy their cartridges. Um, bless them, like to get by series. I, I, want, I want to tell the good people, please. Yeah, this thing is very common among us, of which, and I try possible personally to stay away from this drama and attack. Why do we like to attack ourselves when we issue mm -hmm. when we have money issues? Mm -hmm. Just like maybe only the people is the owner of we are always going using social media in Nigeria, both in diaspora and even here, right here in Nigeria. The issue of land grabbing, in the, like you talk about, issue, talk about issue of people grabbing land. Nobody has not been, everybody has been a victim of land grabbers in a state. Everybody, I am, I will say, even His Royal Majesty, the other, the other I talk about, it, I, I know many of his property in Benin, in not Osh, in India, and Osh, or where Osh, or where, they will go there with all everything they have and they will grab the, the land and sell it to, to other buyers who are interested. So, like what Blessing said, this is the first time that people are coming together, having the courage to go on the street and speak against this evil act. And I'm wondering why are we attacking ourselves? Like I told somebody, like Stan said, cause are becoming. Of course, yesterday I told somebody, we are we are the next generation. Any other person that be criticized, whether you like it or not, we are the next generation. Governor Baseki, Oshomole, Shaibu, Otubu, and the rest of others, they will not stay here forever. We pray for God to give them long life. We want to have our haters. But the truth is that these guys will not stay here forever. They are moving. They are, they are graduating from one state to another. So also, other set of Edo youth will be moving. Why do we like to 
disgrace and attack ourselves every now and then. What for what reason? We have just only seven local government in the two south. Mama Kwe Buse, we are not even enough talkers of we dividing ourselves every time. This cause is a noble cause. The best you can do, the worst you can, the worst you can do, and the best you, the best you can do is to support. The worst you can do is going to just stay clear and not start making statements that we that we trigger unnecessary controversy by about this moment. What everybody said here. Not the, not, the, not the first way they carry for the sharp papa papa for phone. There ain't no password. Or they ain't, they ain't get my password. Or there ain't no pass. Some of us, like what we said, we have we have our image and integrity. We have everything from here to all over to the to, to, to the flag where is pegging in Washington DC. People know us to that at, at, at this event. Like I keep telling people, we have our content. We are not just an activist that just try to make noise. So Everybody, please let's come together. But for you, I can always tell people because we see seen this thing always. When opportunity like this come, people try to shy away. You are for now, you are watching. You are really aware. You have issue with your now, now you don't want to talk. Abi, you are really aware. No wala. Those those who feel that they are overwhelmed and they are proud that at the end of the day, I, I trust God Almighty who dedicate people. God Almighty will also, also put smile in their faces. But those who want to stand and look and be watching from a distance, be looking with your pains in your heart, by the time you say you want to take action, just like what happened in the Bible, the story of the church, uh, uh, virgins, maybe by that time, eh, the team will not wait. As at now, let everybody come together. You cry every day. You don't carry my land. You don't carry my land. I was expecting that the home is going to be full to the beach. On that day, be that land issue is a major issue in a state, and yet you were waiting for those people you feel that like it's a professional protesters. <laughs> because so in, in some of your mind, you feel that like, so not be on the street. We are we don't have anything to do. We are just there, like I'm just in my house, in my living room waiting. By the time doctor come to, to me, say ah, come here, come to come and protest. I'm just be on my chair and just come and protest. Bros, everybody have. It's our own passion. Just as we are sitting here, people, people are there in different of the same building. There is a passion. Wasting 500, 2 million dollar in table and they're just happy. So long you call them for drink, anywhere they are, they can convey and condescend and evaporate and put themselves together. That is the same way some of us see issue of struggle. It's not like maybe, maybe we have all the time or we have all the resources, but it's our passion. That is, that is the reason why we embrace it every time we are called upon. And lastly, let me tell you, if I tell you what it takes for some of us to protest, bros, no, so who, know, who wears shoes? I know for the pain. Personally, color knows. As I protest, bros, not to say that I joke. Me, that personal soft guy on my own, a good day. I don't disgrace myself. But when I move to the street here, eh, when you see me, you'll see that I'm that different person that you see. Because I believe Martin Luther, as he do research, you know they, you know they wear that, in the wear that suit. That doesn't take his own agitation away from him. Even Marcus Garvey, the father of all struggle, the father of black liberation movement in the world, was known for a corporate and a soft person. But when it comes to the street, eh, you go wrong. Please let us come together. Don't stay aside and be looking. When you are looking from aside, you are a traitor. When you don't, when you are your silent is a betrayer. Only those in the field that will be the one that will be vindicated at the end of the day. Thank you very much. God bless you. I want to say a very big thank you to my brother, our brother. Uh, in fact, uh, we don't have other names to it. Uh, we know the faculty of non-peace, the faculty of let's give them fire for fire. I uh, commend your effort that very day because uh, the synergy was a great one. Nobody can act alone. That's why we believe that the system is the collection of parts or events that can be seen as a single whole thing mm -hmm. due to the interdependence and interactions of those parts or events. So, you, you let now, so you let we stand, we stood together as a team. And I want to commend you, you and your submission. And I, I know you are aware, so I will not tell you that what we have done is just the tip of the iceberg. Yes, yes, 
We are determined in our quest to continue. Now let me tell you. Let me prepare you. You have just seen the first segment of Black Wing. Now you are being monitored. Everybody wants to make sure that you are not a perfect human. Your mistake is being searched. Once they see me, they say, we don't tell you. We don't tell you. See how much. See how. Like me, before I choose to engage in any fact, I know they listen to me when we talk. I know how many calls I receive. Say, don't respond. I don't hear that one. Me, go, ah! This, bros, when you are ready to fight, fight, finish. A victor is never afraid of his victory. It is better for me and you to go to relegation than for you to speak me out. You still know how I am. <laughs> for you to sweep us to relegation, Yawabu, I continue. Even if you can't go street, we gain as well. Nobody took their power. But let me tell you, you can only, yes, you can only succeed when the people are with you. Mm. Today I was at the city of office. More than eight diaspora has never been on them. They didn't believe. Let me tell you, they don't get anywhere for this town where anything will happen to one person for this struggle where the world will turn upside down. Yes, sir. We should be happy that we are privileged to serve the people. Mm -hmm. You are indirectly serving the people for now. Yes, you mustn't yes, be a governor. Mm -hmm. You mustn't be a chief of staff. Mm -hmm. You mustn't even be a member of anything to be able to give back to your community. I want to bring our brother in and a Canadian gladiator. Yes, the chief. I cannot call him a political juggernaut for now because yes, but he is a strong academic gladiator. I want to bring up Mr. Bill. I agree to you. Waka Matamas. It's a pleasure that I'm of course this very 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 unfortunate and sad that we are in this very sad state today. Talking about land crabs. As the secretary, youth secretary of the Nigerian Labour Congress in those states, I feel very, very bad that our workers today, let me be very concerned about the two workers who salary to so many of us is less than 30,000 naira when you talk about minimum wage. And majority of these workers, they, continue, they save money, 30,000 naira monthly for years to buy land, to lay something on ground. Maybe after 35 or 30 years when they are retiring, to have somewhere to lay their head. But today, in the district, what is the situation? Like you listen to the teacher that cried out the other day that a building that she has been Building for years, for 26 years, she has been teaching. Only for one or her to just come and fence that place down. A lot of Edo workers today, they are suffering from these land grabbers in the two states. And as a youth in the Nigerian Labour Congress, I don't think we, they have decided that. To say a capital gentlemanta to land grabbers in a two states. Because I am not a victim today. Tomorrow, I will be a victim. You are not a victim today. Tomorrow, you may be a victim. One message I want to pass across to the Edo workers that we all must rise up to join this struggle. It is not the struggle of blessing, it is not the struggle of all I don't it's the struggle of. So sorry, I mean, we may be calling them politicians. They are looking for something to get from the from the political class and all that. But this time around, I want to say this. I have presented the radio program, one of the most popular programs on radio for more than 15 years. And while I was on doing this job, a lot of you watching me, you know the person that is talking to you right now. AK Wakai Bar. For that 15 years plus, most times we get complaints of people collecting people's land, mm -hmm. selling one land to 10, 20 persons and all that. And we have cried and cried and cried. 
And thank God today we are having a group that is saying no to land grabbers. And what we all need is your support. You can't sit at the comfort zone of your house and expect manna to fall from heaven for you to reclaim those land that have been collected from you. A friend of mine bought 15 plots of land from this same community. Only for him to retire from what he was doing to say, let me start investing with this land. 15 plots of land were gone. Yeah, we such person go from there. Today, as I speak to you, that man was frustrated. Left beneath city two years back to turn himself to a bus driver in Lagos. It is so bad. It's pitiable. And though workers, I want to say this clear now, that we shall overcome. And we can only overcome these land grabbers, these land thieves, if you and I come together to join this crusade, to join this movement, to say no to land grabbers. In this note, I want to say this, that we shall overcome. We shall overcome. We shall overcome. He refused to listen. He emphasizes on the fact that he's one of the greatest man who ever lived. But as of today, we are still sending a clear message to all land grabbers. And the whole of them should listen to the biblical inclination. Many, many take care of us. If you fail to listen to it, believe you me, they are going to meet their own water. Uh, that would not be my fault, and it will not be your fault. And let us let us state it clearly. We don't look at any face. Because if you have to check faces in Benin and in the Dosti, we know virtually all faces. Are you getting the point? So for now, we have declared the entire faces of every citizen and Uche. We know the little Uche face. So I want to state clearly, by Friday, by the power of God Almighty, we are going to come out with a central place where you can send your documents to us electronically. If you are on ground, you send it directly. If you are not on ground, send it electronically. We are willing to print them out and submit them to our appropriate portal. Get yourself prepared. This is the task that must be achieved. Now, let me tell you why we are fighting to ensure that land grabbing ends in the dust. Don't be deceived. Land grabbing is one of the basic factors militating against employment generation in every state. And when you have lack of, when you have unemployment in a society, and you have citizenry that are underemployed, it gives room for both adults 
and juvenile delinquency in a society. And that enough is enough to create insecurity, economic imbroglio, and all other problems that may be even repugnant to natural justice, equity, and good conscience in our contemporary society. So, not be saying we're not their work. As we speak today, you know me as the CEO of Omar and the two states, and they move from place to place. But all of us can everybody when they we get each other, this is what they do. But we can't be there and say, no. Huh? You will continue to be collecting money, making money, making money. The environment is there, not clear. Don't give back to the society. You must be ready to give back to the society. And not just those of us who are sitting here. Who is sitting here? Let nobody deceive you. We have benefited immensely from the dope. It is the truth. You cannot say that monopoly has not benefited from the dope. Or the man who just landed up as the CPS of, of a local government. You will say it has not benefited from the people. What are you saying? So we have benefited immensely. I'm coming, yes. Whichever way we are doing it, we have benefited immensely from a dope. It is now a responsibility on our part to give back. I don't think, is, is there any other submission from any person? Uh, I think we have some. I don't people, like we said earlier, even though we believe that the movement of Monday was a huge success, and because of the fact that petitions have been submitted to the appropriate authority, there is a need to continue to follow up on these programs. So on Friday, this Friday, we are planning an Earth Movie press conference. A world press conference. A world press conference. CP. Now we'll, we will be able to articulate issues as it concerns our cause. What is our cause? We are not fighting anybody. You may choose, however, to put yourself in the mix. But we are not fighting anybody. I reiterate, our fight is not against an individual. It is not against a group. Neither it is against it friends. is not against it's not against friends. Many of us have friends and relatives who are in this game. But we are ready to sacrifice our relationship for the good and development of a two state and our people. So, we are asking you to join on Friday. The programs will be rolled out from tomorrow. We'll roll it out so that you'll be able to follow properly. The fight is against land grabbing. It's against illegal encroachments of land grabbers and demolition, wicked and draconic demolition of properties of landowners and property owners, property owners they have been developed to a very substantial extent. It is not against one singular individual. Thank you so much. Yes, in absence, in absence of any other discussion, I think we're about running up, we're running up the press, uh, the media discussion with everyone around the world. But the truth of the matter is uh, most as well. Thank uh, the deputy governor and the governor in Asia for receiving us and for giving us a very strong statement. The speaker. Including the speaker. I want to say a very big thank you to me. And we expect them to match actions with words. We are watching. We want them, we expect them to match actions with words. We already know that for the Ambassador administration to reenact the 2017 law as amended in 2021, it shows that the government is committed. Serious. And we know that there are still some political power out. Who can say that we won't? Yeah? <laughs> we expect the government to check to see every political.